it's got a sinker on it. Mark and it's got ball 60. We don't check the line on that. Yeah, I'm doing yeah, 67 meters to the braid, including the leader. So if we mark the fish at 70 and yeah, so the right on the knot, on the knot, yeah. Lost all electronics. Right in the middle. Yep. You get on the wheel, you get on the wheel. Pull this rigger up for me.
clip as well. down a bit.
So fuck you, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> you, Peter. Well done. Um, That's a nice fish. Uh, um, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna do it underwater. tag just slipped all the way back. So where the notch Jaden's lit the end of it and bent it over and it's probably saved us losing that fish. So unfortunately for us he came all this way and I think at the one day's fishing in on the uh, Friday when we were fishing the lithium on Jaden's boat cut out which holds all the auxiliary all the auxiliary power so the motor runs separate but the lithium runs everything else pretty much. So he lost electronics, but um, he called his sort of marine electrician, Matt Davey there, and he helped us fix it out in the water, which was good, but 
we managed to fish that day obviously which is all the footage we got and then um, missed the whole day yesterday because of the wind and then last night at about 10.30 at night setting up the boat and Jaden realised that it had all conked out again we couldn't get it going we are on the phone with Matt until 1 o'clock in the morning this morning we managed to jump start it with the motor running uh, just at the boat ramp but um, unfortunately we've just launched and we're back in now because we've got about two k's off Burmy and everything just shut down again so we can't run out there without slimy tubes so no one here's what it is I guess that's boats for you.